Good morning guys, it is Friday. I'm starting this vlog a lot later than I usually do. Um, this week has been very productive but very busy. Busy sitting at my computer and doing things that are not really interesting for the vlog. So I'm starting the vlog today instead because I got the news yesterday that the venue I was supposed to shoot at a couple weeks ago is now available for me to use tomorrow so Dylan and I are gonna go there and shoot a bunch of content and it's gonna be really fun I'm really happy that the restrictions are kind of starting to lift a little bit and that we're able to use the space it's just gonna be him and I in like a really large space so super safe but <clears throat> yeah overall I'm really happy about it so I'm gonna plan that with you I still haven't really figured out all of my looks and everything but we're gonna do that together so I thought I would start the vlog today and yeah bring you along shoot some behind the scenes with you and it should be really fun so I don't know what's going on with my hair at the back I always have this when I wake up and I need to tame it down anyways I'm just about to get ready because we're gonna go grab a coffee somewhere and I think we're gonna go do a little bit of groceries this morning. I'm just finishing my first coffee and it's snowing outside so I'm just gonna put my hair up in a ponytail or something and do a very minimal face of makeup because I don't really feel like it. I've got some really nice deliveries this week, so I'm gonna share that with you as well. I got a body cream from, body lotion from Chanel. And it's the body lotion that matches their Gabrielle scent, which is a scent that I really love. I, I got this perfume I, I bought it myself i think it was before even my partnership with chanel um when was it a couple years ago when i went to paris and now every time i wear it, it just makes me think of paris and that trip so that body balm just smells like a dream i can't find a hair elastic but i'm gonna go grab the body balm for you so it comes in this really beautiful glass Square container and if you're familiar with the Gabrielle bottle it has this same sort of square really really nice very novelty I also have to do my nails so sorry about that and then yeah it's just like a tub <laughs> of body cream but it smells so good so luxurious so I got this gifted from the lovely team at Chanel so I was really happy about that and then I got a couple bits from Dior Beauty which I'm very very excited to start working with them um, I'm about to post at 9 a.m. a first IGTV that I did with some of their product so I'm excited about this I'm really excited to post it I filmed that yesterday and yeah, I'm gonna show you the makeup bits a little bit later because now I really have to get ready.
plan my looks for tomorrow. I have a couple of things laid out here, my shoes and my accessories. And now I'm gonna go get some flowers. I'm hoping they're gonna have the type of flowers I want because the sun just got out and it's nicer outside. So now is a good time to get out the house. And I wanna shoot this Simone Russia dress. I also have this look, which is a vintage blazer with my Issei Miyake turtleneck underneath. I have Cecily Bunsen dress number one, dress number two, and then I'm gonna show you my accessories so far. I have my tabby white boots, this nice vintage hat, Prada shoes, my other Prada shoes with the logo on top. I also want to shoot maybe this cute little bag from Neofit, which is a, a store in Toronto. They sent it to me. It's really, really cute. So I thought maybe with the Simone Rocha dress, it could look nice. And then in here, I have my Charlotte Olympia hair clip. This hair clip, which is from the same store of that beaded bag. I have this Chanel um, hair clip that I borrowed for my shoot last week and then they kindly gifted to me um, after the shoot, which I'm so grateful about. It's so beautiful. And then I have my Prada headband. And here I have my Chanel Haribo, which they also gifted to me last Christmas. And then in here I have my Simone Rocha headband, which, oh, sorry, which would look really nice with the dress as well. I'm not too sure. So these are probably the accessories that I'm going to take with me. And maybe this bottle of Chanel uh, Le Lion, which is a new perfume for them. And I think I want to get a couple shots with it, even though I've already shot it for my Instagram. I think it would look nice to have a prop. And because I need more props now, I want to get some ranunculus because I really like those flowers and I think they shoot beautifully. So hopefully, crossing my fingers, they'll have some at the flower shop. Good morning, guys. I am hair and makeup ready. I did just a very sleek long braid with a couple of extensions <laughs> to make it longer. I'm just packing up, finding a way to pack up all my things so that we don't have too many things to bring, like too many bags and things. So I think I'm just going to put everything in the suitcase. It's about, what time is it? 8.55 and we have the space at 10.30, so we're all good. I'm finishing up my coffee. I did some very nice neutral nails and yeah, I'm really excited. I love to do these things. Like it's a very intimate shoot just with Dylan and I. So I don't know, something about it feels romantic and really nice. So I'm excited. So let's get packing. <laughs> It's a good fit for you. So we got to the space. As you can see, it's very open and white and beautiful. Dylan is just setting up the backdrop. 
and I just finish setting up all my clothes and accessories. I'm just gonna show you. So I've got my Paloma wool pants, Isemiyaki little top, black double-breasted vintage blazer, my large color white shirt, Simone Rocha dress, my two Cecily Benson dress. I also bought these two small handbags, one from Rekinen, the other one from Demelier, my Polen leather beret, and then I got a couple of accessories for my looks. Hungry, baby? <laughs> I just changed into my first look. I have my Chanel bow, these nice flowers, my Cecily Bunsen dress, and my Cecilian boots. And we're done for this look, actually. Look number two is done with my Versace sunglasses. Gotta change. Final look, I think. I have my Chanel brooch, my Charlotte Olympia kind of mismatch, uh, Simone Rocha dress, and white tabby boots. Dylan is just changing the lens, I think. And I think after that we're done because we're running out of time. <laughs> I think I'll put some, I'll insert some footage of the walk. It was really nice. We walked all over the pond in the lake. It was all frozen and the sun was shining. Really, really beautiful day. So it's nice to get some fresh air. And no plans for today. I think we're just gonna have lunch now. Maybe do a workout later and grab some coffee. My face is all frozen. I have difficulty talking. <laughs> we just went to pick up a coffee. Very sunny. Yeah. Beautiful day. I just shot an outfit and we just realized that tomorrow's a day off in Ontario. So now we feel all frisky because that means this is not a real Sunday. That means we're off tomorrow and it's like a Saturday all over again. So we don't really know what to do with ourselves. We're gonna try to figure that out. And what did you get? It's a new one, it's a raspberry chocolate. Oh, raspberry chocolate is not that good. You don't know, like fruits and chocolate together. Ah! Oh! oh no, I'm not gonna like that. I got you just a plain one if you want it. Maybe show the box. My sister's calling. Hi guys, it's Monday about 11 a.m. We're just getting ready to go and grab lunch. We did a workout this morning. We had our coffee and we just took it quite slow. And now we're gonna go to Cote de Boeuf. I'm really feeling a nice baguette sandwich. And since it's a day off, we're just gonna um, go grab lunch outside the house, which I'm excited about. 
and I realized I didn't vlog yesterday after the car clip. We came back home, we made dinner, and then we just watched some Netflix and didn't do anything. So we didn't miss much. But I wanted to show you what I got from Dior makeup because I mentioned it and I realized I didn't show it to you. So let me just show you quickly what they sent me because it's really nice. So it's the Dior Rouge line and it came in this like pillowy makeup case which is really cute and it's mostly lipsticks and lip liners and two um, nail colors. I did a reel on Instagram and I wore this one. I really like a nice deep true red but they also have this more orangey color and then they sent me two lip liners one in this new color and one that goes with the red which is really nice and then I'm not going to go through all the lipsticks because you guys can just look at them online but the one that I really really like is this lip balm I think it's it looks so luxurious and it's so nice I've never really seen a lip balm in sort of like a lipstick bullet form so this is really really nice and then the one that I used in my reel which is a neutral color because I like a nude lip it's the shade 100 nude look in a matte finish and it's just this really nice neutral nude color I really love it and it looks really nice with the lip liner and when you wear it with the lip balm it's not really matte and it's really comfortable so yeah that's what they sent me if you were curious and now let's go grab some lunch so we decided to go for Bami instead because the other place was closed because it's a holiday here but I got a lemongrass tofu bami and Dylan got a cold cut is that it mm -hmm. bami and um, looks pretty good mm -hmm. 